Hi, I'm Eileen Jonah Daly. I have been selling real estate for 20 years, uh, primarily in Lynn. Um, I started just helping my mom who opened up her own independent real estate company, Jonah Realtors, and um, I really was helping her with the marketing and advertising. I had three small kids at the time. And uh, the more I got involved and the older the kids got and my time became a little bit more available, I just got more involved in selling. And here I am 20 years later and still selling and loving it. And going back to the way I started in the business with my mother and myself, we were an independent company, female owned. Um, we built the company from just two to 20 people. Um, and I've come from a family owned business. My dad owned a drugstore pharmacy in Lynn and my whole family worked there. So that gave me kind of that entrepreneurial spirit which feeds into being a real estate agent. Um, I'm my own boss in many ways. And um, I think that that helps me from a perspective of working with people in Lynn or even any other client, um, connecting with them and showing them that I I'm going to take it like my own business, my own product, my own house and sell it for them. Getting referrals is my superpower um, and I'd say it's more about experience and the work that I do than a superpower because my clients trust me and they know that if they refer a friend, family, coworker to me that I'm going to do everything I did for them in terms of working hard and making sure the transaction was as smooth as possible. Um, and so there's really no better call than to get from, you know, so-and-so referred me to you because you did such a great job. Again, my experience really, I have been doing it for 20 years. Um, I know Lynn um, from corner to corner and neighborhood to neighborhood. And I think that, as they say, it's a cliche, but all real estate is local. And if you know the town and the market that you work in, um, that just gives you a step up and a foot up um, in terms of pricing things correctly, bringing in buyers, being able to put a narrative to a property um, and really sell it so that the seller gets top dollar and again the transaction is nice and smooth. I'm not as aggressive as some real estate agents are. I mean it's a very very competitive business and you do really need to be constantly pounding on people's doors and calling and keeping in touch. I do a very good job of keeping in touch with my clients that I have but um, Aggression, being aggressive is just really not in my nature, so I really do prefer to work in a more relaxed, relationship-based environment, but I probably could be more aggressive in hunting down people to list their houses. <laughs> Another one of my secret weapons, I'm very involved with the, real, the Realtor Association. Um, the Realtor Association helps somebody like me who has real estate as an actual profession. It's not a hobby, I don't do it as a part-time job. So it helps me associate with other professionals who have dedicated their life in making this a career and networking with them and learning from them. So it feels like you're learning from the best of the best in the business. Um, through that, I have sat on the board of directors for the local association. I was the president in 2015 and I was a Realtor of the Year for Massachusetts in 2015 and that's one person chosen out of 20,000 real estate agents in the state. Um, and it's not just about production, it's about community involvement and how you serve the association. So to me that was probably one of the greatest accomplishments in real estate that I'll ever have, even going into the future. Communication is the biggest thing in real estate and setting expectations and so I really do try and keep the communication open with my clients, even if it's bad news, I'm always making sure that they're aware of what's going on throughout the transaction. Um, you know, the real estate transaction can be stressful and so it's important that the agent is always communicating to a buyer or a seller so that they know what's happening every step of the way. Um, so I kind of stand for that and on, obviously being honest and ethical. Um, going back to referrals, you don't get referrals unless you do the job right and you do it in a good way, in an honest way. Um, so that people trust you and come back to you and again refer your friends to you. So those are my kind of two pivotal things that I try and focus on through the transaction. You need to have a good um, organization behind you and that's one of the things that I love about Century 21. I mentioned before that we were an independent company and that was great for a certain amount of time but as the industry changes you really do need to have a kind of a global presence behind you in the marketing um, power of Century 21 just helps expose somebody's property um, in such a bigger way. So what we do here, which I think again is maybe a little bit of a secret weapon or a superpower if you will, is we have um, 
immersive videos that do geo mapping, which really, you know, all buyers start on the internet. I think there's a statistic 80% and maybe even 90% of buyers start their search on the internet. So what I'm able to do for my sellers is really expose their property in the best way. Again, through the immersive videos and Matterport, beautiful pictures. Um, you know, the first impression is the most important. And so when somebody's property hits the market, it's, it's going to make a great impression. I love all my clients. Um, but I would say first time home buyers are really um, a passion for me. There's nothing better than helping a young couple achieve the American dream. I mean, again, cliche, yes, but it's true. When somebody turns the key on a property, um, I remember one scenario where I was um, helping, it was like an older mother with a daughter and the grandchildren or the daughter's kids. And um, at the closing table, they were crying because they just could not believe that they were finally able to own their own property. So that was an amazing feeling. Best way to reach me is my cell phone. It's my office, essentially. So um, you can text 781-718-7665 or call me. I do answer my phone. And email works, too. It's my name, Eileen, E-I-L-E-E-N, at Eileen, E-I-L-E-E-N, Jonah, J-O-N-A-H.com.